I like drawing joy, so I think that it's good to see her smiling face. One of her best features is her big eyes and that amazing wide smile that she has. She's got this hair and a little point there. And I, I've been asked to draw this before, but mm -hmm. you know, I really need the practice. I can have her standing here and holding the flag. And uh, we can color that in. So earlier you showed us how to draw anger. Yeah. Is that like a, like a set way to draw? Or yeah, well, in story, we kind of have to make little shorthand versions of our characters because we can't draw them the way you see them in the movie. It'll take too long. So we just have to create what they feel like, and they can recognize the features of the character. And we draw hundreds of those oh, right. every day. There must be like a hundred, over 100,000 drawings. There's so much, actually. We, we throw out probably as much as we keep, maybe even more. And um, they're fun to do, but for five years of drawing the characters over and over again in various scenarios and situations, you, you kind of develop a, a shorthand. Are your kids super interested in your work? Uh, my kids were very interested in my work when they were little. Now they, they, they're older, they get to choose whatever path that they want. They, they, they both draw, they love drawing, but they draw for themselves, which is great. That's exactly what daddy wants. Because drawing is a, is a nice way of expressing yourself. And you, you don't have to actually turn it into your job. You can just enjoy drawing for its own sake, you know, and um, you can love drawing as a hobby. I walk around with about three or four sketchbooks at any one time in my bag because I love to draw. Have you been back to the Philippines? Oh yeah, I love going home. Maybe once a year, I go to the beaches. Love the beaches. Yeah, there's Joy right here. Yeah.